here at Town Lake, we're wrapping up the installation of the new Western Dam. And as part of that, we're going to be moving the water of Town Lake into an SRP channel on the north side of the lake. And what that allows us to do is not only to conserve water first, but it also allows us to get at the current rubber bladder dam to be able to remove it. Then we'll refill Town Lake and we'll be back in business. Right around uh, mid-March is the plan to remove the rubber bladders. Um, before then, we're going to be installing some pumps on the south side of the lake that's going to pump uh, the water uh, from the lake into an SRP canal so it could be reused for a later date when we go to fill the lake back up again. But during that process, we'll be uh, pumping the lake into the SRP canal and we will be removing the bladders. We're going to uh, have uh, multiple, multiple uh, crews on the, on the bladder removal to get them removed as soon as possible. Once that's complete, uh, we will start to fill the lake back up and then the new dam will be in, in full operation. Town Lake is so important it, and keeping it, maintaining it is very important to us. And for that reason, we wanted a very long-term solution for the Western Dam. It has a big job to do. It has to hold back all of this water. We needed stable, we needed long-term solution, and for that reason, the City Council chose steel. And the new gate system's uh, designed to last 50 years. Obviously, there's some maintenance that has to go on throughout the process and yearly maintenance, but uh, you know, it's a robust design. And I believe it'll have no problem lasting 50 years. And you know, right now we're currently around about 90% complete with uh, obviously the concrete and the gate installation. Uh, next couple months we're going to be getting the, the equipment started up, testing all electrical controls and equipment, and getting ready to put this uh, dam structure online. We're going to be moving most of the water of Tempe Town Lake to the north side into a Salt River Project Canal. And SRP will use that water for its own existing irrigation customers. Those could be uh, residential customers for their lawns, they could be city parks. It will go to good use for irrigation. Moving the water in this way gives us some credits with SRP when it's time to refill the lake. We'll save some expense there and it also saves this precious resource, our water. Uh, each bladder, a rubber bladder, weighs 60, approximately 60,000 pounds, and the, the rubber is one inch thick, so it's, there's some specialty tools that we have to use just in order to cut this bladder into smaller sections so we can drag each one of these pieces out. The city knows that the spring is an especially great time here at Tempe Town Lake. There are lots of events, there's lots of people out using it. All the pathways will still be open during the remainder of this construction. The pedestrian bridge is projected to remain open as well. We ask that people keep safety in mind, that you don't go into the lake bed and that you bear with us. Please have patience with us. We know it's a short-term inconvenience, but we really do have the long-term in mind here at Town Lake, and we're on our way to a very long-term solution.